Hello everyone, welcome to Home Schooling with Hera. I hope you all are well. In today's class, we shall learn another English spelling rule. This is the rule for using C or K. The sounds are K or K. Why this rule is important? If you encounter a new word with the K sound and you don't know which K to use, this or this. So this rule will help you to make the decision wisely and correctly. So let's see what the rule says. If the next letter of sound just after the K is I, E or Y, we use the tall K means K. Like in kit. Look at here. The next letter is I after this K sound. So we will use K. The name of the letter is K. And here again, the next letter after the K sound is E. So we will use the letter K. Why is it so? This K changes the sound to S when it comes before I, E or Y. So whenever these three sounds are there and you hear a K before them, you should not be confused that what to use because it will surely be the K. K sound with the K. Now what's the second thing? If the sound after K is A or A means A O U or any other consonant, we use this K means C. Like in cat after K we have A, okay. Cup after K we have U and clip after K we have L sound, that's a consonant. Before we proceed, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe it and turn on the bell notification so that whenever I upload a video, you will be notified first. So come on, let's dig into it. Okay, let's look here for some more examples and explanation. This is the word cat, k a t a cat, and this is the word kitten, k e t t a n kitten. Why does it begin with c and why does it begin with k? The reason is this, that if we write C here and then we will write I, T, T, E, N, this word will no longer be kitten, rather it will change to sitten because C has two sounds. The one is K, the hard K sound and the other is like this. Whenever there is I, E, or Y after C, it will change its sound to S. So this word would have been sitten if we have written here C in place of K. Same here, it would have been C if we replace this K with the C because C changes to S when followed by E. This word is a bland cra. This is a bland cra. Ow, a digraph, and n. Cra, aun, crown. Here the sound of C is k because it is followed by a consonant that is r. So that's all for today's video. I hope you have understood this. I hope you liked it as well. If you have liked it, please hit the like button. I shall see you with another video. Till then, bye bye.